guys, what's up? This is Place the Moving and it's the end of the month again. You know what that means? Time for another requested movie review. This time I will be reviewing Lemonade Mouth, which was requested by Pulip Groove. Link to his or her channel is in the video description below. Anyway, this movie is basically about people who meet each other in detention and start their own band. Oh, and by the way, the detention is in fucking high school. Now we're gonna start by talking about the protagonist of the movie, Stella Yamada, played by Hailey Kayoko. She's an absolutely awful protagonist, and she is a total cunt. She goes to high school and has no respect for the rules. She thinks that she can do whatever the hell she wants, because she is protected by freedom of speech. No, that's not at all how fucking free speech works. When you're in a school, you have to follow the rules of the principal. If you don't, you can just fuck the right off. Not only does she break the rules, she also causes hell of a lot of trouble. And I hate characters who do that. I mean seriously, why she wasn't banned from a high school, I have no fucking idea. Now when the protagonist is an unlikable asshole, if it is a protagonist you're supposed to root for, then the movie is doing something horribly wrong. Not only does this movie make the protagonist completely unlikable, but it also makes me sympathize with the villain. Speaking of which, now we're gonna talk about the supposedly villain, Stanley Brannigan, played by Christopher McDonald. He is such an evil principal and only wants to stop fun. And he is also unreasonably strict. I was being sarcastic, by the way. In all seriousness though, his anger is totally legitimate. And I totally understand why he fucking hates the protagonist so much. She is a rule breaker and should be fucking banned from the school. Why he doesn't ban her from that school, I have no fucking idea. That's what he fucking should have done by the beginning of the movie. I mean seriously, he's just doing his fucking job. If I was in his shoes, I would be pissed at that cunt as well. Oh and by the way, this is a musical. And this movie isn't very good in that regard either. The songs are just okay. But there is one positive thing I can say about this movie though. It's not a major thing, but it's still something. Unlike most musicals, people don't start singing out of fucking nowhere. So all the singing scenes in this movie make sense. But that's the only positive thing I can give this movie. It's still a fucking awful one. And I also hate how this movie is painfully unfunny. Now it's time for my overall thoughts. This movie is complete garbage. Seriously, fuck this movie. And for that, I'm going to give it the rating two middle fingers. Well, guys, that's all I wanted to say. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.